So hey guys, welcome back in Kurimanga YT and in this video I'll show you that how you can simply export your game for your Android mobile. Yep, I will be showing you the demo full. Also you find the APA download link in the description link below so you can easily download. Also you have maybe you need the SDK, MDK and JDK link in the description below so you can easily download. Okay guys, so now we are, we are in now PC, so let's go to library, then you need to go in your Unreal Engine 5 or if you have 4.2 district, just click on this little icon, then go to option and then make sure that you have the target flag from that Android, make sure you install this thing. So one is done, just click on, click this one, then click on apply. So that one is this done, done. Now second part of that you need to download the Android Studio 3.5.3 So just search here because I already have the Android Studio 3.5.3 So if you don't have check my description link below I already give there the download link in Google Drive link so you can easily download and install this is for 3.5.3 so which an Unreal Engine want for Android export so make sure maybe you have the some of you or have maybe the Android Android is your last version but we don't need the last version we only need that 3.5.3 okay so make sure you install this one and one is done then click on configuration then go to your SDK manager then as you can manage that here the api labels okay make sure the api levels you check that which api levels and which android version you want just click on the text then click on apply and download so one is done that is the installation complete that android sdk and the android studio then you need the ndk also i give the link in just download and you find the zip file so one is done then you need to go to your files then go to your uh why you save your unreal engine in my case it's fdx.unreal engine folder so at Unreal Engine folder, you find the your folder that UE EA or in a Unreal Engine 4 point, you find the 4 point version. Then click on that engine, then go to engine, then you need to go to X-Ray, then you need to go to Android and you find some files like that. Just run these files one time that the IDL, just run this thing, then the Android setup one time and then the Android the setup of android just a uh, one time open with visual studio 2019 okay you need to just open this all the files in one time as you can see there's are some java code lines and maybe there's also some uh maybe i see that there's some c plus plus code right here yeah the echo and even else okay so one is done so you don't need to do anything change at the code work then click on the updated link so it will be updated your android sdks so one is done then click on the update link lumion okay so all the stuff is now done then what you need to do is just open your unreal engine then go to games then select any of template in my case i'm setting a blank project then you need to set up your project name or your game name i'm giving it name that mobile test once it's one is done then go to set up the desktop platform to mobile and make sure the preset quality to stable so it will be automatically adjust the quality and for the coding we set blueprint and click on create so now it will be start creating the template for you know the template yep and also if you want you can close this all the stuff what you open because you don't need that anymore okay as you can see our game engine is start then click on dismiss and not now so as you can see this is a basically basically a very simple template while nothing here so just click on add it then go to project settings here you need to change something like you need to disable the lumion then just click on none and set it to none and then here as i showed you shadow and which people have the uh, Unreal Engine 4, they don't have this feature that shadow mapping or the, you know, the Lumion. So you don't need to change up that thing you didn't find also. So yeah, then you need to go to render or the packaging. Then at the packaging, make sure you maybe have the key bucket list kind of like that. So you need to just click on this dustbin. Then click on the advanced and here the make sure you click on create compress cook for a package. And then this one. Uh, okay that the executable that only cook the map only affected okay so once this thing done then you need to directly go to your android and android just click on configuration now and now you need to set your game package name make sure that it should be unique kind of like igi 
डॉट एम एम एस डी ओके काइंड ऑफ लाइक ए वेरी यूनिक दैन दर इज अ मिनिमम एस डी के एंड बी टारगेटेड द मिनिमम इज दैट द लोएस्ट हाउ मच एस डी के योर गेम नीड्स एंड द मैक्सिमम और द टारगेटेड इज दैट द रिकमेंडेड दैट योर यूजर कैन फील गुडली दैट इट्स कैन रन गुडली सो एज यू कैन सी इट्स बाई डिफल गिव इट टू लॉलीप दैट ट्वेंटी वन इन माई केस आई कैन सेट इप टू थर्टी बिकॉज आई हैव द एंड्रॉय थर्टी एस डी केस ओके बट आई एम गिव इट टू ट्वेंटी then uh, the installation location that intel to set it to auto then as you can see small uh, force to obb files then click your package game data instead of apk so all the stuff are now done so you don't need to do anything of google android sdk uh, the google stuff okay then simply go to your as android sdk so here you need to pick up your file that sdk just click on this three dot and pick up where you save your sdk the file should be like uh, if i show you that in my case it's save in my navida code work dot sdk file just click on like that it will be automatically quick so once this thing done go to android again and make sure in maybe your case if you do first time in your case the accept sdk license should be disable or it should be you know that the disable so you need to click on the accept sdk license and click on agreement and it will be agree and kind of like that as you can see there's nothing here so once this everything done click on save this thing and create a simple map okay as you can see this all the stuff is done then click on edit project settings then go to maps and set up your map which are new created in my case it's new map and the default game mode base and then click on save then click on and platform then go to android and as you can see your android icon is now visible then go to packaging then set any of location then click on select the folder and it will be start the processing or the yeah exporting for android so it can be take half an hour for export a blank project also so you just you need to just uh, wait some time okay yeah just wait okay guys so once you finally export your game you find some notification from unreal engine like they give you a folder like this that android just click on this file so you find a installation.mrr a text file you don't need that file also also you don't need the installation.text.mrr so it's a basically guide that how you can install okay so here's your app now you can share it with your any of friends your friends can now download and enjoy the game so i just hope you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel kori mangla yt and also for For more videos, so you can check my YouTube channel. That Kodi Mangla Vaiti. There's a lots of videos available. Yeah, there's a thousands of videos available. Not not thousand, only more than three hundred video available. So yeah, you can check them and enjoy them. So thank you so much and bye bye. Sometime.